Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to the Cantor Publisher video lessons. Before starting the lesson, dear student, you must have with you class 4 English textbook, resource pack and summer pack. Resource pack is for parents and teachers guidance. You can also download it from Cantor Publisher official website. We will start our lesson from unit number 3, markets in big cities of Pakistan. SLOs of this lesson are learn about present forms and past forms learn the difference between simple present tense and simple past tense now look at here page number 18 of your textbook we have a grammar section here what is a simple past tense i know you are familiar with the past tense we have discussed the things in your previous class too past tense is used to talk about an action that started in the past and ended now past tense kya hota hai jo kaam aapne पास्ट में शुरू किया हो पास्ट आपका दो घंटे पहले भी हो सकता है एक दिन पहले भी हो सकता है तीन चार साल पहले भी हो सकता है और स्टार्ट हो और अभी तक अभी खत्म हो जाए मोस्टली पास्ट फॉर्म ऑफ वर्ब आर फॉर्म बाय एडिंग ईडी एट द एंड सम इरेगुलर वर्ब्स नीड टू बी लर्न टू मेक पास्ट टेंस हियर द पास्ट प्रेजेंट एंड फ्यूचर वी हैव थ्री टाइप ऑफ टेंसेस माजी हाल एंड मुस्तकबिल now look at this here we are playing in the ground during break time today here the action is continuing it is happening right now so it is a present tense here present tense wo hota hai jo abhi maujooda taur par koi kaam ho raha ho jaise ki isme hai playing in the ground during break time today abhi isi waqt aaj ke din continue hai presently wo kaam ho raha hai yesterday we played in the ground during break time played as I told you here, we will add ed to first form of the verb to make it in a past tense. Look at here, play is the first form of verb here, which we use in a present tense. We use it when the action is happening now, right now. We just add ing to it, playing right now. As you can see here, eating, walking, it means it in indicates that the something is happening right now, presently. But if we add ed to play it, it means that something has happened in the past. Koi kaam kuch der pehle hua hai, do din pehle ya kuch arse pehle hua hai. To kya hai? Yesterday. They played yesterday. Guzre hua din mein unhone break ke time khela. So, Played is the second form of play. It indicates that something that action is happened in the past. And some irregular verbs are also there. Which don't have ed in the second form of verb. Like how? Eat is the first form of verb here. And what will be the second form of verb here? This is the irregular verb. It will not include ed here. The ed, we cannot say just eat it. No, it's wrong. It's irregular verb. Its formation will be different. Its second form will be ate here. Yes. Like I am eating mango. The action is happening right now. Oh, I eat mango. Here. How we will use this second form of verb? I ate mango in the morning. It means that action is this eating mango is done in the morning. I ate mango in the morning. Mene am khaliya. Matlab ye kaam jo hai past mein ho chuka hai. Now look at here in the table below. Verb from 1 to need ed to make past tense, whereas verb from 6 to 10 need to be learned as irregular ones. Here, 1 to 5 sentences need the addition of ed here to make it past tense. This is the first form of verb and this is the second form of verb. Any action by the noun. The present form indicates that something is ri happening right now and the past tense Indicates that something has happened in the past. Past situation can be anything. Like 
two hours before, five minutes before, yesterday, two days ago, like this. Here, this is the first form of verb here in present tense, which is indicating the verb is taking place right now or in the present. In the past tense, we can see the addition of ed here. This is the regular verb here. We just added ed and to make it the second form which indicates that something is happened. All these actions happened in the past. Talked, laughed, played, jumped. Now look at here on this page. 6 to 10. These are the irregular verbs. That I have told you eat, ate. We will not add ed to make it in the past tense. See. Saw, saw is the second form of see, go represent present tense and went represent past tense, the second form of verb. This is the first form and this is the second form. First form represent present situation and the second form represent past situation, a verb that has happened in the past. Swim, swam, drink, drank, there are lots of example of this, catch, caught. bring, brought. Now this is your exercise here. Write the past tense and form in the blanks. Okay, look at here. These are all in the present form, the first form of verb. What you need to do? You have to make it in the past tense. You have to write the second form of verb here. What will be the second form of cook here? Yes, this is the regular verb. It needs only ed addition here. So, we will write ed. Clean. It also need ed here to make it past ed. Yes, we have discussed the play. Played. What will be the shine? Here the second form of shine is shined. Right? Yes, this is the irregular verb here. The second form and the past tense will be the wrote here. These are all the first form of verb, the present tense. We have to change it in a past tense. Asked will be asked. Sing, the second form of verb sing will be, yes, this is an irregular verb. So, it will be sang. Turn, yes, it includes ed here. Turned. Help, Yes, help, save, saved. Fight is an irregular verb here. So, it will be fight, fought. Look, looked. So, this is another task here. Read the following table to differentiate between present and past form of verbs. Dear student, we have learned the concept of the present and past tense here the present and past form of verb. So, what you need to do, you have to identify the simple present tense and the simple past tense here. Simple present tense have first form of verb and the simple past tense have the second form of verb. So, here I see a cloud in the sky. Yes, what is the verb here? Yes, see. See is the first form of verb. So, it is a present and saw here the second form of verb. So, it is a past tense. I want you to read all these sentences here. It will more clear your concepts. Look at here the page number 20. Question number 2. Fill the blanks with the past tense form of verb given in the brackets. What you need to do? The words given in the brackets are the present form, the first form of the verb. You have to change it in a second form. To simply read the story, this is told to us in a past tense. So, you have to change it in a past tense. All the given verbs in the brackets, you have to change it in a second form of verb. Let me do the first one for you. Yesterday, I see. Yes, we have discussed this. See is the present form, the first form of verb. And what will be the second form of verb will be? Yes, saw here. I hope you can 
identify and change the present form of tenses here into second form. Now look at here, section C, mark the right answer from the given choices. For each sentence, for each five sentences, we have given four options here. What you need to do, you have to choose the correct option for each sentence. Look at the first one, which tense is used when we talk about an action that started in the past and is finished now. Yes, we have discussed this. An action that started in the past and finished now is called, yes, past tense here. Look at the second one. We form simple past of by, by adding ed at the end. Some irregular verbs need to be learned to make what? Here we are talking about the simple past tense. So, the right option will be past tense here. Look at the third one. Which tense is used in the following sentences? We work on computer every Thursday. Here, they work on their computer every Thursday. Like their, this is their routine. Every Thursday they do this. So, this is the simple past tense here. Very good. Look at the fourth one. Which tense is used in the following sentences? Last week, Hassan took two sick leaves. Here, the took is the action and the second form of verb. So, it will be the, yes, simple past tense. Look at the fifth one. What is the past form of verb blow? This is the irregular verb here. So, the right option will be blue. Yes. Dear student, this is your homework from summer pack, page number 17. And from page number 18, 19 here. And this is your page number 16 from your textbook from unit number 2. What you need to do, you have to give it a read and identify the present and the past form of verb here. Just underline it. Both the forms we discussed in this lesson, you have to underline both forms in this page. This is from your unit number 3. I hope you can do this very easily. I hope you have enjoyed my lesson. Thank you.